Hey everyone, now this is also my awesome worship tutorials and I'm a worship team guitar player at the New Testament Church in Eisenstein and today I'd like to teach you how to play This Is A Move by Bethel Music. So let's get started. This song is being played in the key of G and it's also the first chord we'll be playing. You can play it like this or like this by using your ring finger on the top E string and your pinky on the bottom E string. That's the way they play it. Going into a C over G. As for the picking pattern, try to improvise for that part because it's a good practice. So that's the chord progression for the intro, G to C over G. Repeating that as many times as you like before heading into verse one. So verse one is being played as followed. We're playing a G, going into C, to D over F sharp, to E minor, and back to C. So that's the chord progression for the verse, actually all the verses. And the first time we're playing it, we're just improvising with our picking patterns. And the second time we're playing a verse, so verse two, uh, we're actually doing some strumming. So I will play everything together before heading into the chorus and then explain how to play it as well. So this is what it sounds like. progression three times and after that we're just playing C G C G so all together it sounds like this and you can sing it low of course or you can sing it high it doesn't really matter that much Depending if it's beautiful. <laughs> so this is the last time. This is move. This is move. From C to G. And again. This is move. This is move. So we're playing that part twice. This is a move. 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 Okay, joking. But anyway, um, when we're singing this is a move, we're going to play slowly. Uh, slowly. So we're not playing that loud anymore. We're actually going to hold back a little bit before heading into verse 3. So the third verse is being played as follows. The same chord progression as all the other verses, but we're really building it up. So we're just doing downstrokes. So.
to the tap Playing it very slowly This is me Repeating it twice This is me This is me Miracles happen Bridge Miracles happen when you So we're just playing C to E minor, C to E minor for the bridge. And as you might have noticed, I'm just doing one downstroke. So the first time we're playing it, we're just doing one downstroke. The second time we're playing that bridge, so we're repeating it. Uh, we're doing some downstrokes, but not too loud, but we're building it up. And then the third time we're going to the climax, going to the roof, roof, roof. And then we're really building it up and exploding, playing it out loud. So I will play it and you can try to play along. So first time, slowly. Building up. going into bridge two actually so this is move or you can go back to the chorus it depends on what you like or prefer so anyway at the end when we're singing uh, heaven is coming for the last time so I'm doing D before going into the chorus or bridge two I prefer to go to the bridge too so playing C to G actually the whole time Except the last time, then we're going to an A minus seven. And then to C and to G. So when we're singing this is a move, we just keep playing C to G, C to G, C to G. But the last time, so the fourth time, we're going to an A minus seven. And then to C to uh, the C and then back to G. So I will play the last two lines and then it sounds like this last time you can even play the G over B in between So you can end the song like that. If you're not ending the song, you can just repeat that C to G and go back into the chorus if you prefer or back to bridge one. It all depends on what you love to play. And if you're playing in a band, it all depends on the worship leader. Uh, if he says, not a time, let's uh, repeat it, then you repeat it. If he says, go to the chorus like this, switch or whatever, you switch to the chorus. So this is actually how you play the whole song. Uh, and I hope you've enjoyed watching this uh, uh, guitar tutorial actually. If so, don't forget to hit the like button, like our Facebook page and don't forget to subscribe. 
God bless and we'll see you guys next time. Later.